Hey everybody, GamerBoy9800 here. We're back with our Rome Total War Greek City States Revival campaign. And last episode, I remember we, I believe, I think, took Corinth and Larissa and Kydonia. I think those, that's what we did all last episode. I remember last episode also talking about raising an army to go take Halicarnassus. But as for now. Right now, I'm going to well, let's Seleucid for a second. It kind of looked like rebels. All right, good thing I had my uh, Seleucid allies. Let's take a look at the finances. Forty-five hundred next turn. Let's see. Uh, train two units of pop lights there just to have some extra defense. Hold on, someone's trying to Skype me. Let me uh, pause the game real quick. Alright, and we're back. Sorry about that there. Some, someone on my Skype tried to call me. Told him I was busy. Alright, let's get back to the campaign. Alright, so Pergamum has some public order we need to work on, but I think it, it'll be fine once we get this palace built because that's what they want. See Syracuse, also in the same condition. Probably gonna have to wait. It's, we're not gonna raise taxes just yet in Syracuse. If we do that, we don't want them in blue. We'll just keep them at red. Why are they over one thousand or well, over twelve thousand less income? I don't get that. Anyway, I think we should take Syracuse, not Syracuse. Why did I just say that? I meant messing on. Away from the Skippy Eye so we don't have to worry about them over there. And now there's Broody Eye territory up there. I want to go and take Athens from the Rebels. But I don't think we're going to do that just yet. I'm going to build a port just so we can get some trade in. Train two more units of armored hoplites to there, so I can probably scrap up an army and go take Athens. I'm gonna spy up here. Thessalonica and Bizalora aren't really guarded that well, because it looks like the uh, Macedon, Macedon uh, don't have too many big armies left. I don't know if they have any big armies left actually because by looks here it just looks like they have a bunch of smaller armies. That might be all they have left. There's their faction heir and a family member. Let's see. Family member. I wonder where their faction leader is. Anyway we're gonna end the turn here. I had a feeling they'd do something like that sometime down the road. I'm just not expecting it now, but I can easily defend myself. Alright, so... Yes. I'll get some trade going with the Syracuse. Oh, the Scythia. I should honestly be able to kill them easily. Strong. I'm. Oh, Gaul's the strongest faction. I'm the most advanced and the largest. That's very good. Corruption of Etna. Something siege. Um, let's see. My lord? My lord? I'm going to start to get an army going here. I'll temporarily decrease their tax rate since it's not very high. Set. 
Yeah, I'm gonna just go and take Athens now, so I can get more income once I capture it. That means more money for me to spend on my armies and financial business stuff. Alright, so we're gonna end the turn again. Pontus agent detected and a turn. I'm now the strongest faction. A birth, construction, recruitment. Britannia and Germ Germania have to cease fire. At first I thought it was allies, but now Gaul and Britannia are now allies. So that pretty much indicates that Germania is in some big trouble if they go to war with either of those two factions. All right, let's check over here. Yeah, it says 20 to one. I'm just gonna auto resolve this. There's no point of going on the battle map. I'm gonna exterminate that settlement. Build some militia barracks and trade and that and some mines. It's going to be pretty good for me since, let's see, I'm going to build a market there, another market there. I'm going to start to try to get my economy to boost. Alright, I've taken advantage of the uh, money that I got. Let's end the turn again. Ah, uh, looks like Macedon's cooking up a big army to try to come and take me. I don't give a crap, sure. If you were to ask like a thousand or more, heck no. Looks like there's a bunch of Roman broody eye. Alright. He has some light lancers. So it's not this is not an army I'm too worried about. Other than his Roman generals and maybe this phalanx pikeman, that's the only thing I'm those are the only units I'm worried about. I'm gonna keep an eye on the broody eye here, because I don't want the marching army towards Thermon and taking it from me. I gotta get them off of this peninsula. Let's see, what else can I do here? Um, Building a market there. I'm gonna afford it. Yeah, I'll I'll build some city barracks just so when the time comes, I can get armored hoplites. Oh, there we go. All right. So it looks like they're going to try to besiege me, Larissa again with that army, but I'll easily be able to defend myself. Alright, so diplomatic relations. Carthage, Numidia, Britannia, and Germania are war. Germania and Gaul have broken their alliance. Germania and Thrace are now allies. What would they want to do with the Thrace? I don't see how the Thrace would be too big of a help for an ally. Oh, well, looks like they got an army here. I'll just wait them out. I'm confident I could easily win that battle. 
because their armies are crap. And then soon I'm gonna go up and take Baisalor in Thessalonica and maybe try to build up an army and sail around to try to take Apollonia. Apollonia, yeah. I'm trying to pronounce that right. Anyway, so let's see, we got small army here. I want to go and take this rebel settlement, but I could be a bit challenging. I could train some uh, peltasts to take along with me, just so I can uh, try to see what kind of army they got going for their over there. What kind of army does he have? Oh, well, he has uh, one, two, three, four, five hostati, one, two, three equities, which are a pain in the butt to freaking chase down because they're so fast. Three units of, four units of war dogs, three units of elites, two um, general bodyguards. This army doesn't look too threatening. I bet you it's mainly composed of militia hot fights. Um, how's Syracuse doing? Blacksmith is being built at the time right now. I'm gonna end the turn. I don't think there's too much I can do right now. <sighs> What's Egypt want? Trade rights, sure, I don't care. More money in my pocket. 170 uh, denarii isn't really anything to me. I'm the richest faction there is, boy. Just to look at the faction rankings, I'm going to go for the top five, actually all the living factions overall ranking. Military ranking, I'm number one. Booty eye. Uh, Macedon have uh, steadily dropped and are slowly raising again. The worst one out there so far is Thrace, who only have maybe a tad bit under 12,000 men. I owe, I have almost 60,000. That's pretty insane. I can hold these guys off, like I said, and... Let's see. I don't know if there's anything else I can do after, during this turn. I try to build up some armies. Um. I don't. I mean, militia cab can be good for skirmishing and harassing the enemy, but. Cavalry wise, the Greek city states just have crap, probably some of the crappiest cavalry selections there are in Rome Total War. So I don't know if I want to pursue anything in building up my cavalry. I mean, they could be useful in sometimes, but not too useful. Not like Macedonian cab or like cataphracts or any other good cavalry like that. I'm gonna build two units of armored hoplites there. Nothing's happened yet. Although I'm certain that here in the next turn or two, Macedon's gonna finally decide to try to murder me. I think that's the maximum of range they can get since they actually have four melee units on foot and the rest is cal ca cavalry. <laughs> cavalry. I'm gonna end the turn again. There we go, that's what I wanted to see. So, r right before I go into battle, I'm just gonna tell you what I have, which you can see down here. I have five units of hoplites, two units of Cretan archers, 
one unit of Peltas, one unit of Mercenary Peltas, one unit of Mercenary Hoplites, your General's unit. I will see you guys on the battlefield. In the sight of the gods, they do not rejoice to see All right, so by night, though, they will rejoice. Let's go to deployment. No, I'm gonna just guard this. Come on. We set up my man. Of my general here to uh, rally my men. I think that's all my men. Don't think I have any more to set up, so I'm gonna start the battle. Militia hoplites, I can cut these guys down easy. Get some up close action of the arrow fire. Don't go out there. Dang it, some got sometimes my archers can be real retards. It seems like my uh, Peltas aren't really cooperating. There we go. Sorry about that. I uh, didn't realize I kind of ran out of time. Get my guys back behind my hoplites. Hoplite. 
Let's take some shots at these guys. Now we must rely on men to be our new wall. The walls are no longer ours. The enemy have taken them. Alright, so they're coming in. I'm just going to try to fire on them with my archers. I just ride those Peltas. And these Light Lancers are going to get eaten up by my Hoplites. Pretty confident I'm gonna win on this flank. Yeah, I'm probably not going to actually win this one, or well, this front right here. Well, these guys pretty much fighting to the death. The gods have filled the enemy general with fear. Now he flees the field like a coward. See if we can try to kill this general. Nope. This general got away.
Yeah, I killed the enemy in general, so that's good. general around here and then try to charge into the back of these levy pikemen to break them. Right, here we go. Let me give you an up close view of this. charge into the back of them and yeah these guys routed now there goes the phone oh my gosh all right so I pretty much won this battle pursue them drive them from the battlefield See you back on the campaign back. Alright, we won that battle there. I knew I could hold my own against stupid Mastodon. Crap, death stops up. God dang it, stupid plague. I have to retrain my guys until it goes away. Hoping it doesn't spread to any other songs. Family tragedy, boo hoo. I announce Scythia and Thrace. Win this naval battle here. Ships ready. Yes, Captain. I think after this next turn, I'm gonna take some of these guys and roads and try to take Halcarnassus and Lower Turkey. Um. Well, I think I'm gonna wrap it up here. By the way, that. Oh wow! Just I told you earlier that it's probably just mainly composed of militia hoplites and I was right. Anyway, I'm going to save here. Thank you for joining me on this episode. I am Game Boy 9800. Thanks, yeah.